Josh Jr. here for another rock counting adventure. Today I am up on a small tributary dumping into the South Umpqua River. I am just right off of uh, South Umpqua Road, I, uh, National Forest Service Road 28. And thought I would bring you guys out and along, drop my uh, little picker tool and show you the incredible spot that I'm at. You can see there behind, right there. And I'm finding a few little things. Nothing too spectacular, which I wasn't really expecting to find much up here. So, we're finding some stuff. So, we're doing okay. Didn't know what we was going to find up here because I don't know this area that well, so I was shot in the dark. And I did find an agate. So, there we go. But I find out there's cool stuff, as usual. I'll bring you along. Hey, we did better, I've done better this trip than what we did the last one when I was in the, the Malala River. So I'm going to look around and I'll be right back with you. Okay, I'm back. I think I found something pretty cool. Put my tool down. Look at this. Beautiful area. Lots of rocks to look for. But... Whatever it is, it's a keeper. So it goes in the pocket. Well, I'll keep looking to see what else we can find. These rocks all look peculiar to me, weird, different, because I'm not used to it, to uh, this area. But I'll get used to it quickly, let me tell you. Okay, just as I put you guys back up, found something else that's pretty cool. No denying this one. Okay, I see something peculiar here. I'm going to toss my tool up here so I don't lose it, because I don't need it for this. So it's right there. And the light caught something. And now, I'm going to take you guys swimming. Now, I warn you, when you come back up, you're not going to be able to hear me as well. But I'm going to take you swimming and see if I can pull this up with you guys swimming with me. So here we go. Just a small one, but it's one. Okay, I was over here looking at this hole and I see some interesting stuff. But I want to go turn around to step out. And, oh, gotta wait for the water to clear up a little bit. I might, it might have been laying that way, and I could have kicked it with my foot. Not too bad. Always turn around and look where you came from. People's feet kick a lot of stuff around, especially my big size 13s.
Okay, I'm back. Hope you can hear me better. I'll try not to take you guys swimming anymore. But this here has got my attention. Sweet. That's pretty. Huh. That's a nice find. That looks different than anything else I've picked up. Doing good. Prime example of turn around and look where you walked. That's just a small one, but it'll go in the jar. Yep, always turn around and look at where you walked. Another smaller one. Okay, we're further down this little creek. One of the nicest ones of the day. That'll be a nice tumbler. So I want to keep looking and looking and looking. Okay, I think I found something. Yep, I did. Keep looking back to where I was at to see if there's anything I could have missed. Let's look at this here. Might be a reject, but that's fine. See, you don't know how many times I'm bending over and picking stuff up. That's rejects. Always in hopes. Nope, nothing there. This could be interesting. Huh. Just a second, let me pick it up and feel it. Nope. It's not. That's a typical reject. Goes back in the drink. Okay, I think I found something that's either going to be really cool or it's a reject. I thought I'd turn it on and share it with you guys. No, it's a reject. As soon as I touched it, I knew it was a reject. Shoot! Okay, everybody, I had to come back and track down the Mrs. Jaws Jr. 
you know, I've got to keep my eye on her. You never know what she's going to walk away with like this. That's almost, I hope the camera's picking it up, but that's almost a blue. That is a blue in there. That is incredible. I was finding it's little brothers and sisters. So she did fantastic. Hey everybody. Well, we left the other spot. And yes, I'm in the middle of the creek again. We're about four or five miles up river I guess is the best thing to say and so this is the first minute of being here found something so this might be pretty promising I'm either lucky at the very beginning or we're doing pretty good but let me turn you around what else we have here that's a reject pretty but not what we're looking for that sandstone type stuff so I'm going to walk up here you guys are probably seeing what I'm looking at maybe not Nope, nothing. Okay. If I find something else cool, I will show you. But hey, I'm not skunked at this stop, spot. We found something right away. Okay. Standing here in the middle of the river. Gonna look down at my feet. That's interesting. I don't know what you can do with it because it's sitting in the host rock. It's sitting in the basalt. Mount but that's pretty cool. Well, here is the find for everything that we found today. And this is what Mrs. Jaws Jr. found. And again, that incredible agate. She also found a piece of petrified wood too. She did really good. Then there's a little bit that I found. So, I think this in here is my best piece. But I also, let's walk over here, Uh, it doesn't show it that well, but this has got quartz all through it. You can see some of it right there. It's all got quartz all through it. When it was wet, it was actually a bright red. So, and oh, by the way, if you're not sure what's going on, we have got the Mobile Command Center out down here at South Umpqua Falls campground. It's a national forest campground. Ten dollars a night, no services. But that's okay. We are doing just fine. We don't need to be plugged in to have a good time. So again, that's what we got. Got to finish doing dinner and call it a night. So there you go. The first adventure. For this weekend. There should be some other ones coming up quite soon. Uh, I'm not sure on how I'm going to be able to get them recorded or filmed, but I'm going to do the best I can and would love to be able to share these uh, next couple days with you. Uh, some fun stuff going on and a lot of, uh, a lot of hard work is going to be happening too. So for now everybody, just remember, everyone's life is an adventure. Then there's mine, camping and rock hounding. This is the Adventures of Josh Jr. Have a good one, everybody. See ya! Ha <laughs> ha!